So, things we cover this week, more or less. We covered the pronoun. Okay, hold on, because this is not working. Should be working now. Pronoun. Demonstratif. Meaning that we know that un means a, a, an apple, or one, un, une, it's feminine, and de is plural. This becomes le, la, les, the, the, the. We know that each word has uh, is either feminine or masculine, even a table or a door. Now, when we want to say this, again, it changes according to the sex. So it's ce or set if the word coming after has a vowel, etc. Set. Yes, they sound the same. But they're not the same. And se. So if I say une balle sur la table, of course, we know this means a ball or one ball on the table. If I want to say the ball on the table we will say la balle sur la table quelle balle which ball cette balle this ball okay so a the this Uh, let me change colors. This. There's nothing to it. You only need to know that when you have a masculine word, this is going here. If you have a feminine word, this is going. And if you have plural, this is where it's going. Now, <coughs> excuse me. We also covered a little bit... <coughs> the um, possessions pronoun possessif so we said that my becomes mon if it's masculine ma if it's feminine and me if it's plural your becomes ton, ta, te. And his or hers, in English, who has possession is important. That's why we say his or hers. In French, it's the opposite. The subject doesn't matter. Well, not in this case. But the object does. So it's, for instance, son chien, Okay, her dog. Sa valise, her luggage. And ses papiers, his, pa his or her papers. So this is bas basically what we did um, the past 10, 12 days. This was the last lesson here. So I asked you to learn these. We haven't done the plural forms yet, but I expect you to know these things. Okay, we also did a dialogue, which was le cartable est sur la table. 
So there's a table, kind of. And there's a school bag on it. OK? Où est le cartable? Le cartable est sur la table. We did a little bit of a dialogue together. I expect you to remember that. Uh, the MYP3s also went a little bit further. They did... Um, they actually had this example. They had a bed. They had the bag here. And they had some shoes here. <coughs> Sorry. So, où est le cartable? Le cartable. And not les cartables. Okay? Le cartable est sur le lit. Lee is the bed. And then, où sont, où sont les chaussures? Notice how the first is a, sh is a thick sh and the second one is a s. I expect you to work on that. Chaussures. It's a very nice word to train your tongue and your mouth. Où sont les chaussures? Chaussures. Chaussures. Repeat after me. Chaussures. Chaussures. And the answer was, of course, les chaussures. Sont. Just a second. Sous. Le lit. And not les lits, because that would mean the beds. Le lit. Okay. Sous et sur. Notice the difference. Sur. And we pronounce the R. Sur le lit. Sous le lit. So, we did this dialogue. I kind of expect you to remember it, so we can practice on it. And with the MYP5s, we also did this um, extra little dialogue which was qui est ton ami and this is in parentheses because if the fr friend is a female then we put this and yes we still use this i know it's masculine but it's one of the exceptions so qui est ton ami i think it's because it i put that example so we can um, get into the exceptions little by little so qui est ton ami mon ami, c'est toi. Et son ami à elle. And her friend, her. It's a French expression. We will see that further down the road. Je ne sais pas. So, this is it. Next week, we're going to look at this verb, which is an irregular verb because it's time. Um, and how to say don't or not in French. But for now, what is important is the possessive. And you need to practice this because you're going to do it in the group. For those of you who were not here, um, please repeat after me. Go back to the video and repeat after me every phrase and learn how to uh, respond because uh, I will not um, allow you to look in your books. Um, so that's it. This is what we had to do. And also... Some of you had uh, to make a small expose about a uh, famous French person. I put the list on manage back. You can choose whoever you want. As long as you don't choose the same as your friends. Um, that's it. I'll see you in class. <laughs>